It's a lot. So we, we spend about eight hours a week in rehearsal. Um, and then the game is, is really an all day Saturday thing. Um, so I would say maybe, I'd say it's around 20 to 25, depending on the week. We have afternoon rehearsals Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. For Thursdays, I start my day waking up at 5.50. It's a full morning tonight, full band. So marching band is actually sort of the soundtrack to all of the football games and kind of the heartbeat of the university. You know, everyone rallies around the band, you know, for the fight song, the school song, and just to keep the energy going throughout the game. I really like the football culture here, and I knew that being in the band would like directly involve me in a lot of that. So that was kind of one of the biggest pull factors. We're definitely in like game mode the week before. I know, I know some holes blowing up some animals is totally cool. Just making sure for a 2 p.m. kickoff time, we would get there at 7 a.m. probably and then rehearse for two to three hours at the bubble, which is the indoor facility, repping our halftime show, pregame, some stand tunes. And then from there, the band is split up into several smaller bands. Each game day, we have two game day parades, which is Bevo Boulevard and Stadium Stampede, where we walk Bevo into the stadium and then the football team in. And while they're doing that, the rest of the band is eating our game day meal, which is barbecue, Texas barbecue. And then um, we will go back to the building and kind of do final touch ups, make sure we've got everything we need um, before we march down to the stadium. And then once we're in the tunnel, we usually have 20 to 30 minutes um, before we march out on the field for the game. It's a lot of anticipation, especially since we're kind of waiting there for whenever we get the cue to go. So um, we're chatting, we're all excited, and then and Texas fans really cheer us on. And we always are able to understand how much our fans appreciate us. And then just, you know, just going and being playing loud and at the same time doing what we know we need to do. It's a lot of energy and it's a lot of time. to be honest, but um, I would say probably conducting the stands, especially when it's a closer game, um, it's really fun to just be cheering and to have the band like right where I can hear them. I'm really glad I get to be so close to them because they are super energetic. They get so hyped up. And you know, we're playing in the stands in the first and second quarter, and then after halftime we go back in the stands and play for the second half of the game. Game days can get brutal, especially when they're, it's a 2 p.m. kickoff. Longhorn Band is great with the way that they organize our game days. They give us some like post-halftime snacks. We get waters when we go into the tunnel. But without having the rest of the drum line doing it with you, it would literally not be possible. It's brutal. There's nothing else like the atmosphere on game days and at events that we perform at and the bus rides. Like, we all just get to hang out and have fun. Every, everyone says the best part of band is the memories because we do so much. You know, going to like pretty much every game, this season especially since we have a lot of Texas games, and putting together really good shows that are really fun and just, you know, saying, looking back and saying, wow, I did that. I mean, it's just, I'll, I could not be more grateful that I had decided to join the Longhorn Band, truly. It's been the most transformative, like, the, the tower has, like, like, the core purpose of the university is to transform lives for the benefit of society, and I truly think the Longhorn Band embodies that <laughs> in the most pure sense of the, the purpose, um, and I definitely see that in my life.